Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your next 72 hour energy reading. Um, do like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into this Leo. Thank you God for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message. All right, so let's see, Leo. Let's see, Leo. All right, the sun card, very nice. And you govern the sun, so lots of exposure you could be getting out in the sun. You could just be getting a lot of exposure, I don't know, social media or something. Lots of people are um, exposed to what it is you're doing or what it is you are building, your brand here, um, you all together. Um, there's a need for you to stay strong. There's a playful element about this too. Maybe childishness or uh, dramatics here. Let's see, what is this about for my Leo? What's the advice for Leo here? What's the advice? The Eight of Cups. Go on this journey. Go with it. Um, it's going to lead you somewhere. You don't know where exactly you're going or you're taking this thing, but do go with it. You could be dealing with a Piscean person. You could be traveling also with this person. Um, there's a tough emotional choice or that, that you have to make, okay? Um, because there's some discontentment or some some boredom. Um, you don't you're not getting your needs met here. I don't know what this is about. You may choose to move or move out or move on or something of that nature here. Uh, in your career and finance sector, it says go with this new thing because it's going to lead you somewhere. Uh, maybe on a self discovery journey here too, because there's a void bit being filled in the in the movement in the moving away up from. Okay. And for some of you in the love and romance sector, it's just about finishing up and moving on. It's like, I'm going to finish out the lease or I'm going to finish out my obligation or I'm going to, you know, let the children get older or finish school and then I'm going to move on or something about obligation, finishing up and moving on here. Let's see what this is all about. And not even making a whole lot of noise about this either. What's the outcome here? What's the outcome? What's the outcome? Ooh. Okay, the Queen of Wands, so you create something new, something dynamic. Um, you get a lot of eyes on you. You are attracting something. You are seducing. You have a seducing energy. Okay, the Queen of Wands. Um, so the Queens are the doers of the Tarot. So you're going to be doing something actively creating too. They're the creators. Uh, so you are getting into a creative space here. Um, you could be traveling or thinking of traveling. Wish. I heard wishful thinking. Um, you met somebody new and they maybe have promised you travel. Um, you really like this person. Are you thinking about what you can create with this person? Um, you're at the bottom of the deck here with the strength card. Uh, it says, keep your emotions tamed here. All right. Keep your emotions tamed. In terms of other people, other people's money, mystery surrounding the other person. It's like your mind is going at a, you know, a thousand miles an hour in terms of maybe someone else. And something else here. Involvement in it or. There's some mystery. There's a shroud. There's a, you, you can't see or you don't understand what's going on. You feel like somebody leaves you out of something. The outcome is you creating your own thing. The outcome is you putting yourself out there. You becoming very dynamic for yourself. The outcome is you um, maybe around December. Okay. This is what I'm saying. Like with the Eight of Cups and the Queen of Wands, this is like finding your life purpose here. <clears throat> and having that inner strength and that intelligence, the courage with that strength card to do so, um, the, ability, the ability and the knowledge to do so. Um, the Queen of Wands is all about life purpose through creativity, I believe. You're just going to get a, gain a lot of self-awareness and self-actualization. It's going to be very confident and not afraid to kind of present yourself to the world. Okay. 
This is associated with fidelity, warmth, warmth, and substance. Um, so it's like you don't know where this career path is leading, but it's going to lead you somewhere um, good and great for you. Okay, um, it's good news on the way for you in terms of your career. Um, you want to make some smart financial decisions too with the Queen of Wands showing up. Some of you could be checking out emotionally of maybe a relationship too. Just trying to remain strong here, trying to finish something up and move on. I don't know if you're gonna finish up school or you're gonna finish up something. Um, don't walk away from this. I don't know if you have a habit of jumping from one thing to the next to the next. Don't walk away from this. Um, stand your ground in this, okay? trust the process be loyal to it all right that's what i have for you leo if it resonates for you go over to the website book your own reading there take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you leo many blessings to you